Blessings black people, this is Queen Sister on this battlefield. I'm here at the Board of Education Chambers. Because they have the City Council meeting and the Board meeting going on at the same day, and they know you cannot be in two places at one time, uh, <laughs> they got me rolling like a yo-yo. A, a but this is just a, an example of the facade that you witness from where you are that takes place in the city of Chicago. It's, it's not about them and the board me members. Many of you are wondering how it is that they serve two masters. And I'm here to let you know that they work for the devil. And I'm gonna introduce you uh, to the devil. You need to know parents that they work for you. And they will never tell you that because you are the power. Now I'm gonna ask you all to stand up for your children because black parents are responsible for black students. They're not gonna give you your option to homeschool. <laughs> I am a homeschool urban counselor and consultant. Uh, and for those of you that realize that the classroom is no longer a safe and conducive place for education, you need to consider homeschool. And remember, you are your child's first and forever teachers. On the dumbing down of Common Core, it's enough to make a plantation Negro become a runaway slave. There is no way that you can convince your children that you care for them and send them into the lion's den, into a burning building. So you can set your lips, parents, and tell your children that you love them, but genuine love is not spoken with the lips or heard with the ear. It's felt with the heart. And they don't feel genuine love because they know no one is truly fighting on their behalf. Therefore, the anger that they express is validated. It's just misdirected. And it's on us as black parents, as black adults, to provide the black child with guidance. I come to clip Dirty Birdie's wings, and she's not here. MOB, Mothers of Black Children. On the strength of education, we will be assembling at the Illinois State Building 100 West, Randolph, Chicago, Illinois, downtown, 4 p.m. Now I can beg you sisters and you mothers to come out and stand for your children, but I'm not. If you care, be there. If you don't, don't. Time will tell. This is Queen Sister, one love, one nation, one village.